Hello, Henry from Belgium here. Today, I show you my latest find. Keep watching the video. I had been looking for LEGO Set 6395 Victory Lap Raceway for a long time. As always, I do my necessary research on BrickSet.com. This set is the most valuable in the racing theme and an average value is around 150 euros for a used one. I normally never buy online. But I couldn't pass this one. I ended up paying 65 euros for the set and 5 euros for shipping. I was assured that it would be complete, but of course you can never be 100% sure. Let's see together what's in the box. The set dates from 1988, so everything is over 30 years old, including this manual. The fact that the manual is included is a very big plus. It adds a lot of value to the set. All pages are there, what is good. Some small tears here and there, but no major problems. It is good that nothing has been scratched with marker or pen. So a good start. Let's look at the minifigures. There are 13 figures in this set. It is a set with the largest number of figures in the town theme. Three of them are unique to this set. There are also some signs of use on this one. I also see that the color of these pants is not correct. Luckily, I have another one here. There are four drivers, seven employees, and two viewers. So next is the service truck. I immediately see that the rope is not the original. But it has been restored in a clean way. Better to replace than none at all. Fortunately, the accessories in the cabinets are present and original. The truck has a standard hook on the back adapted to the special blue tow trailer which is one big element. Surprising for the 80s. And now the race cars. There are two different types of rims, yellow and white. There are four race cars, each different, but constructed exactly in the same way. The structure is trivial, and ordinary bricks have been used to construct it, so there is no problem to create more of them if necessary. One special block was used, 2 by 3 slope brick with number printed on the front from 1 to 4. Let's see what's next. There are also two carts for the mechanics. In the 80s, there was no special small wheels under the carts, which were created later, and can be found in the set 6397 Gas and Wash Express from 1992. In this case, the wheels are made using small round flat bricks. So let's start building the racetrack. There are two 32 by 32 plates, both with the same printing. The set consists of 516 parts. Most striking in this set are definitely the grandstands and the footbridge over the racetrack. I see that some parts are discolored by the sunlight. Maybe later I can replace these parts. This is a nice piece. Item 2448 and it only appears in 8 sets. Also nice, a big board hangs on the footbridge to control the race and display some results. The board has a movable element in the form of arrows. Just behind the stairs a professional stand for a cameraman is located. The camera can rotate 360 degrees, move left and right, and also move up and down.
After just under 2 hours of building I had this beautiful result. And to my surprise, everything is complete. So a very nice find, for a low price. You can add a few more street plates and create your own racetrack. Hours of fun guaranteed. Feel free to comment under this video and subscribe for free. Until the next video.